Please handle with care. Fragile. Thank you. Please be careful with my heart. <laughs> and I bet you they just toss this around. Oh, hello, baby P. Hello. Well, mommy gonna open this. My budgie straight away. He wants to help open up this one. Now, this unboxing is free. Free. Because I'm free to open what I want. No, okay. I'm not gonna sing. Did I sing actually? <laughs> I don't know. Now, hang on. Open, open, quick. There you go. Now we just take this one. We hide that one. So you don't know where I live. <laughs> Some of you said, yes, I know where you live. Okay, my budgie's screaming again. Oh my goodness. Come here, baby P. Big sook. Okay, now let's begin opening this free box. Free succulents. Woohoo! Hello there. My name is Liz, a self confessed succulent addict. Welcome to my channel, Growing Succulents. When I say it's free, <laughs> it's free half equivalent to because. They gave me a certain amount and I took uh, sort of the equal amount. And so now, yes, very standard. Look at that, standard, standard issue. Freebies. These are 100% freebies. Beautiful, they grow such beautiful plants. Oh my goodness, and look at this one. Yay, firecracker, look at that. Beautiful, hairy, but gorgeous. Now, how many freebies do I have? Oh my goodness, look at this one. Oh, so pretty. And that one, that looks like a suyon, a really stressed suyon. How do they call it this? And there's another small baby and big baby. Koigo koro, something like that, pakifilum. I'm just going to go through the freebies. More, look at that, beautiful. I'm going to have to go through their website and look up the names of this one. But for now, I am going to put them separately and another one. Look at that one, oh, gorgeous. Yellow, look at the beautiful lemony color. Gorgeous, isn't it? And look at this one, this one. Oh my goodness, hang on, I need a container. The freebie plants alone are equivalent to like a plant hole. This is actually more than what most people's plant holes are. So this is just freebie. There's more in the bottom here and I'm sure probably I'll find some more. Look at that one. That's a crested one. Gorgeous, 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 beautiful. How many freebies? Are one, two, three, four, five, nine. Nine different types of succulents that are free because they can thank you thank you thank you greenland gardens very generous thank you to leanne and the staff thank you so much much appreciated and now we can start the unboxing i've got another free one so this one is i think something with a rose name on it i think this is pansy beautiful gorgeous delicate look at that ah oh, beautiful it's like a pansy rose. So look at that. Freebies! Woo -hoo! Say for example, I was selling succulents. If I were to sell this at even $10 each, look, a one, two, and eight, nine, ten. Even if you say $5, so that's like $50 for free. Who gives you so much free stuff like that, free plants? Thank you so much again. I'm so happy with my freebies. That's it. I'm going to have a cup of now and I'm going to go to bed. I'm happy. No, we still have to open this one. Their plants are not for the faint hearted. If you have sort of a weak heart, <laughs> please <laughs> don't buy from them. No, I'm just kidding. Because the plants are so big. They're so big. I can't believe this. So it's really worth buying mature plants in clusters than having one small ones. Because if I knew then what I know now, I wouldn't have bought small PC little plants like this and try and grow it for three years just so I can have a cluster of five or six, some even only a couple. See, so now it's better if you buy the advanced plants because you're already ahead and you cut your times of growing or growing times 10 times faster. You will have more plants than I did because I've been growing succulents for six years now and I feel like I miss out in the first four years because 
I haven't got enough succulents to put in my garden. Had I been buying like this, like all of this, then I would have filled up my garden by now with succulents. But anyway, let's begin. I'm gonna move my camera over here. So happy, hang on. There is something about buying succulents that is just so satisfying. Back in my younger years, when I used to buy shoes and bags and clothes and that sort of thing, waste of money by the way, is that your satisfaction or, grat or self gratification basically only lasts up until you wear the clothes or wear the shoes and after you wore it once, you come home, you take it off, that's it. The feeling's gone, but succulents, you open it up like this one, this is Sempervivum, there's no name, uh, species, oh, oh my goodness, so beautiful. This is like an Echeveria, look at it, oh wow. Look how beautiful that is. That's why I thought I'd just get one and see what it looks like. And if I like it, I will buy some more. But these ones at the moment, they will be sleeping soon. But since we've been having a lot of cooler weathers and lots of rain, they are going to continue to grow until the temperature, because they are temperature driven. I don't really believe that they're driven by the season. Because most people will say, oh, in summer, they go dormant. If you have a cool summer and the summer is between, say, 20 to 25, max 28 degrees, and you get a lot of cool nights, Sempervivum will still grow like crazy. This one now, I already have, this is Cherry Danko, I have, I think, Blush Danko. So I thought I'm going to get the cherry to see what it looks like. Oh, cherry red. <laughs> I've got the TV going and the budgie going. Look, no more surprise, no need to surprise you because you already know the plants are good. But do you still wanna get surprised? But look at that, isn't that gorgeous? Oh my goodness. Oh, cherry danko, the blush danko is only blush, sort of a more yellowy tone. And I was actually thinking they're fatter, but less colorful. This one is smaller leaves, should I say, on the diet, but they're much, much, much pinkier, more beautiful -er. This one is such a big cluster. I have a Chivaria Setosa variety, the Manuta Cross Lilacina. I bought a couple of small ones like this, like individual ones, but then when I saw this for $48, it's a big cluster. This, you can see that this is a lot of plants and the one I got at least minimum say ten dollars a plant or something like I think there were eleven uh, for the plants I got but where I got it from they were having a sale so I got it on discount but it's gonna take me a long time before I could grow cluster like this because I love clusters and they look so much better and you can chop 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 at your heart's will at your heart's content but it's gonna take me like two, three years. Okay, I'm gonna have to, look. Please close your eyes, okay? Close your eyes, are you ready? Open your eyes to that gorgeousness. Oh my goodness, so beautiful. It's so beautiful. And you got a one, two, 10, 11, 12 heads. So for $48, $5 a head plus, lots of babies and even the back here, look. There's all babies underneath there, and that one, and there's inside there as well. It's a beautiful, nice cluster, isn't it? Gorgeous! Now anyway, these ones are flower stalks. They're all flowering, and I could harvest the leaves and grow some more babies from it. But isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful! Oh my goodness! My heart! It's just... Uh, hang on, is that how it, how it sounds? I'm beatboxing now. Now the next one. Sedum Multi Alice Evans. I paid 22 well only half, so $11 because yes. Now I could have just got the value of what they were giving me, but I feel bad. So I thought I will buy equal amount. <laughs> so as an example, next time if they give me $500 worth, I'll have to 
to free voucher, then I have to buy another five hundred dollars worth. So it's just technically they're just going to be giving me fifty percent. So now she's going to send me an email again saying we got a voucher for you. No, I have to stop now because I have to look after these plants first before I keep buying. But anyway, I could already see. I've been after this plant for a while and they are quite expensive. So there's a variegated form of this, but who needs a variegated one when you can have the ordinary standard ones looking like this? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh gosh, so delicious. It's like lemon drops. Beautiful, beautiful, lovely colors. I love it. So if you have, and this is also a cluster, so that's why when you do buy them and you're buying them from one head like this people are selling them for I don't know eight ten twelve dollars per head so it only equates to say three heads for twenty two dollars and you got all those other ones one two three four five six seven for free basically and it's already nicely colored up because the ones that you're gonna get are mostly on the center green side and it still takes a while before they color up actually someone asked me she's a plant seller she was asking me how do Greenland succulents or Greenland gardens sorry Greenland gardens or say Greenland succulents or succulents from Greenland gardens that's better how do they get them to color like this and I said, I don't know. You gotta ask them. <laughs> That's why I just buy them already colored up, much easier. Now this one, Yamato Haru, four heads. I have one, two Yamato Haru. I think I got two Yamato Haru. And so this one now is I bought one confirmation Yamato Haru. And so I confirmed that my other Yamato Haru is Yamato Haru. But this one, oh my goodness! Oh, oh my. Lordy, Lordy, Lord. Okay. Okay, I'll surprise you again. Okay, close your eyes. Close your eyes. Open them. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> oh my goodness, so beautiful. Such a beautiful, beautiful plant. Four heads I got and for $18. So very cheap four dollars fifty a plant oh i'm so happy with these plants if only i'm not half asleep but anyway it's keeping me awake this one is i like this one there's two of them it's called lemon rose look how big that plant is and this is only twelve dollars each so are you ready so i'll open this first and you close your eyes okay you ready open your eyes to this gorgeous two beautiful lemon rose lemon rose i actually have another lemon rose that i bought from someone else and i paid 18 dollars about the same size as this but 18 dollars this one's only 12 dollars so technically i only paid six dollars for them because again it was discount yay <laughs> so anyway the next one is Where's the label? I lost the label. Puli Lienseyana. So you can close your eyes again and I'll open this. Close. Open. <gasps> wow. Beautiful. Look at that. Oh, gorgeous. And look, a one, two, three. How gorgeous. Okay. There's one baby here. Four babies. Ah, 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 okay. <laughs> Look at that. But I am going to plant this as a cluster because I love clusters. So GLG, Greenland Garden Hybrid for $28. Paki. Veria Elaine. Now, Elaine, this is, okay. Are you, okay, so close your eyes again. Close them. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Ta-da! <laughs> Look how gorgeous and fat this one is. Oh my goodness. So this one is what's being shown online. And this is what I bought. And this is what I got. So if you think, oh, they've given you more plants. No, this is what I paid for. So there's a photo of every plant that you get. They were actually mentioned whether uh, they'll get you a similar one, but roughly about this size and about that look. 
or they say you will get what is in the photo and this is one of those that is in the photo beautiful pachyveria elaine like fat this is a small one so sedum joyce talak if you got joyce talak you already know what it looks like but this one is a delicate little plant so only small but it's because they are so beautiful and my variegated one because variegated plants they're quite oh precious look at that <laughs> oh so gorgeous so that leaves is already dry anyway it's not gonna grow so we chuck that out and isn't that cute the one I've got is actually Tola and it's a white and green variegate so that's why I thought I need a pink variegate look at that beautiful gorgeous oh my goodness so yummy I could eat you now you stay here okay I'll put you over here next to that one see doesn't that look pretty already <laughs> so if you do an arrangement roughly it's like you put all of this in a big pot oh my lord now this one I already have like three scarlet and I could never have enough scarlet so I went and got more scarlet because again I want to put them in a pot just one pot one pot will rule the world now this is I think a multi so or four heads or something like that so smaller ones and I've got another one there with a double head so anyway if you've watched my videos before you already know what they look like but we'll pretend you haven't okay so close your eyes Ta-da! Look at that. So this one is not as colorful as the other one because the more colorful ones they have has already been sold out. So this one is a little bit on the lighter colored side, but believe me, when they color up, they're actually like a bright red like this, only the translucency of that one. So if you put that one and that one together, this is what it looks like when it's colored up and it's absolutely beautiful so i got one that's a forehead for 14 dollars. so again that's four dollars fifty a plant now i also got a double head so this is scarlet double head see twelve dollars so six dollars a plant and this is bigger than the other one all of them together look they be one big happy family we are family look at that gorgeous in a few months time we will see the color especially in summer a lot of these plants will color up in summer so agavoides actually goes the color sort of pales down in summer but again it depends where you put it this one i don't know what this one oh this is pink crystal i got one pink crystal before so this is only 12 dollars and of course i only paid six but equivalent to but anyway so this one now i thought it's just so gorgeous look straight pink crystal very crystally and very pink and the other one here would be also the same so now i've got three pink crystals so one two and i got my first one the bigger one i bought from them as well so that's why i thought i'm gonna get two more why didn't we know about succulents before why do i only know about you now the last six years i wish i knew about you longer so by now I will have a garden full of succulents. All I've got left here now are big ones. Joanne Daniel Multi. Now, when you say, oh, 28 is expensive, this is actually cheap. If you consider buying one, even at our local hardware store, you're, it's becoming expensive now. So even the small little pots they've got, they were $3, but really, really tiny. That's going to take you like forever to grow them, like two years <laughs> before you can get it to this size, at least two years because some will take longer to grow but this one's already grown to perfection so there's no ifs no buts you just okay hang on Pedro said you sick okay has she there you go <laughs> beautiful isn't it uh the I got a couple from them earlier on from my previous plant haul from them and the ones I got it's more colorful than this because now the other ones of course some will color up nicely actually the other ones are sort of similar i've got a video somewhere where i've done an arrangement and you will see it there it's just so beautiful that's why 
when I saw it. I didn't think it's possible for them to get colored like that. So that's why that prompted me that I should go and get some more Joe and Daniel. Now this one, I paid Agave, $22. Species. So this one now, I am going to have to move this across here and move the other one here. Now this one's such a big plant. When I saw this, I just got to have it. I have small ones that's colored up like this that I've grown myself. But this one, I don't know if this is an agave or hawothia, but I don't care. <laughs> it is absolutely beautiful. So it can be whatever it wants to be. <laughs> it has the right to be called whatever. Maybe we should just call this instead of agave. Agave SP. We can call it SP beautiful. That means specially beautiful. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my goodness. So I think this is actually Hawar. It looks more like Hawarthia coactata. So I think it might be Hawarthia coactata. But it doesn't matter. It is so gorgeous. I remembered paying uh, $15 for one head of a longer one. So I think this is another form of Hawarthia, not agave. But it doesn't matter. They can call it whatever they want. They grow plants so beautifully. Now this one is actually ready to go in the garden. But if I put this in the garden, I have to put it somewhere out where the sun shines because or else they will lose their color and go that color over here they will go green if they're grown in the shade so this one you want them to color up like this you have to expose them to the frost and also to the sun more importantly so now you can go here beautiful one you're especially beautiful now the next one another beautiful plant this is sedum Pakefilum Koigokoro. Koigokoro for $32. Now, it's only $16, okay? <laughs> Who are you fooling? I'm not fooling anyone. It is. It's like, technically, I paid just $16 for this, didn't I? So, now. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, <laughs> I love it. I love it. I'm not going to cry of happiness. I'm just going to be shrieking with happiness. Okay, I'm not supposed to do plant hold videos, but who cares? You only live once. I'm sorry, my dearest lovelies. If those people get upset because I've got plant hold again, I'm sorry. You can't blame me because these plants are just absolutely beautiful. Okay, gives me joy to present to you. Koi gokoro. Koi gokoro said them. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love it. Oh, and it's fat. Look how fat those ones. I don't know if this is their hybrid, but anyway, I haven't seen it anywhere before, only from their website. So, is this a hybrid? Not too sure. I should probably ask them. It's absolutely beautiful. They gave me a cutting of one before, and I just love it. So I thought, I'm going to get a big cluster this time, and look what I've got. So anyway, you stay there, beautiful one. Now, there's only two left. Two. Now, one is, okay, red blush. Now, this is just standard issue, and I paid, okay, this is a multi-head, again, for $28. So, when it says multi-head, it'll have about four, at least, maybe five. So, maybe four, because it's quite big. Even three, because that's really big. I can feel it's like a big plant. So, with this one now, no more surprises. Let's just pull the band-aid, okay? Slowly. <laughs> because it is absolutely beautiful. So this is red blush. I have red blush ready, but I just want to see the red blush, what it looks like. And look at that. Ah! This is, oh gosh. So, okay, I only have a couple of red blush, by the way. I think three. Three red blush. And... I got uh, another two that I bought from Ikea with no name, of course. So I wasn't sure whether it's a red blush, but it does look like my other red blush. But because it doesn't have a name, I thought I need to propagate my red blush. And the other three that's in the pretty pot, I don't want to remove. So this one will be propagated. Do I propagate you? You're so pretty. I can't do that. Yes, I have to. 
or else I'll just be forever gushing uh, on my plants. Here, baby pig, come. Come, Pedro. Look. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, look at that. Yummy. Yummy. My budge is interested. Okay, we put that here. That beautiful red blush, Pedro. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yay. Very cheap. Very cheap. He's hanging on to... Okay, come on. Last one, baby P. Last one. There you go. Now, last but not least, this is... No, actually, there's another one. <laughs> Nana Hukumini. I got a couple of individual plants. So I thought I want to get a big show pony. So I need a cluster because it's taking forever for me to grow them into cluster. Well, they're not growing into cluster and I really want a cluster. So I thought I might as well get a cluster of Nana Hukumini for 48 so $24. That's all it cost me, my Nana Hukumini. Look how gorgeous that is. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, how can you say no to that? Hey, look at that. Beautiful. Oh my Lord. Beautiful. So I want to 16, 16 plants. Like, never been kissed, never been touched, but totally beautiful. <laughs> beautiful. Oh, 16 little gorgeous rosettes. My budge is still on my shoulder. Oh my goodness, I love this plant hole. Okay, after this, I promise I won't buy any more. And no, I always say that, but anyway. If it happens, it happens. Now, what's wrong? So my budge is complaining. Last one. I already have a lot of Letitia's, but because we have frost, Letitia's quite sensitive to frost. So they will look pretty during winter, but they do suffer from the frost. And then they spend all the time in spring and summer and autumn looking pretty again, only to get hammered by the frost again. So my Letitia's still alive, but worse for wear so I thought I'm gonna buy a Letitia that's already colored up and I'm gonna put it in a nicely secure area so I don't have to T-O-R-T-U-R-E it. I'm gonna keep it beautiful and pretty all the time. So my screensaver on my phone is actually a Letitia, my Letitia that I've grown and colored myself a couple of years ago. And one of my nieces asked me, is that real when she saw it in person or was it plastic? So I don't know if it was the same as colorful as my one before. We'll see, we'll put the photo side by side. But this one now, I'm gonna color up like, oh my goodness, that is so pretty. I will definitely be coloring this up because mine was actually at the height of its beautifulness. <laughs> at its prime, it was actually all like this color, all of them and actually even darker. And every time, a friend of mine who's into succulents as well, every time she comes here, she just gushes over those plants and then I kind of miss it. So I thought I'm gonna get a proper Letitia again because my Letitia is gonna get a couple of years to grow again to this beauty. So I thought I'll get this one and then keep it safe, look after it, not abuse it. And then that way I'll have something that will stop my heart every time the budge is trying to talk as well. So every time I go out. So anyway, guys, I think she needs, I mean, he needs his mummy, a eh, baby P. Now you're pr pr preening himself like he's, don't drop some dandruff on me, Pedro. So, okay, guys, that's all I've got for you for this video. I hope you enjoy this plant haul because I am really enjoying, oh my goodness, I'm screaming. I'm so excited. It's just so beautiful. I can't get over it. How beautiful are their plants? Oh my goodness. So now it's time to take a proper photo thumbnail. So people will watch. Look, Pedro, come, come, come. So people will watch and look at all these beautiful plants, baby P. Look, I'm trying to trick him to say, oh, look at that. Don't eat my Letitia, Pedro. Hey, it's red. You don't like red. You only like white. Hey, well, now you can't eat that one. Hey, <laughs> what about this one? No, that one too? Okay, you just go to mommy. Anyway, say bye-bye now, baby P. Bye-bye. Tissue, you want a tissue? Look, tissue. 
you're over tissue he went through a stage where in he just kept eating tissue anyway that's all i've got for you guys thank you so much for watching i'm now gonna be busy potting them up and putting them away because no more lonely nights for me just busy busy nights potting up these plants okay bye 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 baby bye 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 say hello hello bye bye but this one, baby P. Look, look, camera. Hello, bye. Pedro saying goodbye. Okay. Mm -hmm.